going on you guys gas and bass here and yes i am back uh been mia for a while because i've been working and i don't really ice fish because if you know we are from the midwest wisconsin uh right now everything is frozen it's still snow outside but we are getting close to springtime and opening season but yeah uh if you can tell from the title what's in the box i just purchased something that i wanted for a while uh i'm just gonna unbox it for you guys and hope you guys like it um and pretty soon i have something coming and you just gonna have to wait i am very excited <laughs> it's big that's all I'm gonna tell you guys for right now. It is big, but uh, yeah, let's get into this unboxing, all right? So here it is. Just playing, you guys. <sighs> I'm trying to do this one-handed because I don't know where my Joby went for my camera. I think it's in the garage, but let's open this up here. Very excited. I know what it is, but I know you guys don't, so let's see what's in the box. <clears throat> yes, you guys, I bought the Lawrence Elite 7. Yeah. And I bought some accessories and stuff for it. And and I wonder what's this going on? Wink wink. So here it is guys, the Lawrence Elite 7 Ti. <clears throat> Let's unbox this. But so far, all the reviews and everything sounds promising. And I did get the total scan, which total was $7.99. Uh, if you guys are interested in this stuff, I will put all the link for these stuff in the description below. But yeah, total scan sonar, chip sonar, built-in GPS, and wireless. Alright, let's open it. Oh, little card. Welcome aboard. Here to help. Let's see this. This bracket that comes with this finder, which I will not be using because I did buy the RAM mount for this piece, which I will show that in a bit. So this is hmm, transducer. Man, that thing is heavy. It's pretty big too. Let's see what else is in the box. Here's the head unit. Sorry. Just doing everything in one with my hand. Look at that. Oh, oh man. Ain't that a beauty? It is touchscreen also. The back of it. With the 
quick release. Yeah. Feels real solid, feels nice. And what else is in the box? That's just the mount. The mount it in place. Uh, transducer bracket. Let's see what else is in the box. That is. I'll check it out. The plug and the fuse. Another cable. I guess this is for the power. Yep, power and ground. Some bolts and hardware with a zip tie, or two zip ties. And let's see. Instruction manuals. Quick starts. And like I said, I did buy the total, total scan and a combo setup. So this is my inside pro or my map I'm guessing but yeah let me sort this stuff out and I'll uh, get back to you Alright, so the setup here, like I said, the Lorenz Elite 7Ti made it on to a RAM mount for Lorenz, uh, the Hook 5 or a Mark 5 fish finder that does mount onto the Lorenz Elite. Then this box right here, if you guys are interested, is actually a Yak Attack cell block fish finder mount that basically just screws on to or slides on to your rails. So that's plus. Sorry I didn't show you guys the installation and putting it all together. It's just that I was so excited. Plus I just got out eating. I just want to hurry up and get this done because I actually have work tomorrow. So, everything is all mounted up, just ready to go on the kayak. And if you guys are interested too, this is a RAM mount transducer arm with a RAM mount ball. Uh, I've got the diameter. But it's a diamond place, uh, diamond base. Then it goes down all the way down to the transducer. For being the elite, the wire is quite long. Even though it shows you can wrap around here. So my wife told me, hey, let's you know wrap it around the arm so which we did which I actually like we wrapped it all the way around all the way here left some slack then wrapped it around and around and around left some slack then back to the fish finder but man that thing is a beauty and like I said, if you guys are interested in any of these products and stuff, 
I will have a link down by this description of everything that I have on this. So if you guys are interested, check it out. I'm not sponsored by any means. But man, I am so stoked. This thing came out like flawlessly and I love it. I just can't wait. Can't can't wait for spring to come around. Spring or hurry up. It's just around the corner, but it kind of hurry up because I can't wait to use it. I love this this cover right here. I don't know, it just me. It just looks so nice. Pop that off. And bam. One thing that was kind of like I don't know, like a downfall. They didn't give me these little plastic, like designing right here these little plastic tabs they're supposed to come like with some blue ones but I checked all over the boxes checked everything and I cannot find it so I don't know I might just send an email or something but it's kinda like whatever I wanted it to be blue but yeah but this is how it is Oh man, I just love it. I need to charge the battery so I can actually hook it up and turn it on and see if it turns on. Pretty sure it will. I just have to charge my battery. Yeah, put the RAM logo on it, tell people what's up. But. I am excited you guys. I am so stoked. I'm so excited. Yeah. Here it is, you guys. My setup for 2018.